VHS is always in the process of asking what's next. We had uh, investigated uh, robotic solutions like everybody. We saw products that were put out into, into the market. I just didn't see uh, where the economics uh, would work. And it's inherently expensive because of the choices that they were making. MaxAI is a new technology we've developed that's based on neural network and artificial intelligence. What MaxAI is, is uh, an artificial intelligence that uses machine vision that looks at every object, is able to use the visual characteristics of every object to decide what that object is and place it into a category. Think about the camera as the eyes and Max AI, our neural network capability, is really the brains behind what's going on. By adapting the neural network, is able to see material in the same way that a human would. So how do I know that a pet bottle is a pet bottle? Because somebody taught me. Everyone that I see then doesn't have to look exactly like it. I can still tell that it's a pet bottle. Max will be able to do the same thing. Max thinks so fast that it can decide does it belong and if it doesn't belong, where should it go? And because this is based on a vision system, it's not bounded by a particular polymer or a particular fiber or uh, something that you can see in the near-infrared world. When I put Max on a sort line, I can sort aluminum cans. I can also sort cardboard. I can sort PET. I can sort polypropylene, all with the same unit at the same time. Uh, it'll see the quantities we'll tell it percentages that we want, and it'll create exactly that product. And that just means more margin. No longer are we relying on special expensive NIR hardware, we're not relying on um, LiDAR, we're not relying on sophisticated color detection, we're simply using a frame-based camera to make that decision, and so that really is what pushed us away from sensory-based detection into neural network-based cognitive recognition. We think this gets right to the heart of making recycling profitable. So right away, we're going to be able to lower operating costs and improve margins because uh, we'll be able to capture whatever was otherwise going out the door. Importantly, we're able to do it at a price point uh, that's very attractive. So the long-term vision for Max AI is the capability to make decisions for the entire plant. You can deploy these vision systems throughout the plant. The plant now has a brain, and that brain can see everything that's going on in the process in that plant. We'll be able to control every part of the system, so that'll include not only uh, the opticals, that'll include the max QC of screens, it'll include air density separation through our NEHOT technology, and it'll include every piece of equipment that you see from infeed all the way out to bale. Every piece and process in between will be covered. Our operators are now going to be able to focus on the other things in their day that make their owner money instead of running around looking at conveyors all day trying to figure out what tweaks they can make in the process. This is going to be revolutionary for this industry. To make it to this huge milestone is just a big deal for, uh, it's a big deal for our team, it's a big deal for BHS, and it's a huge deal for the industry. It's very clear that what's next is really an important part of this process being willing to say this is what needs to come next and we will find the answer to that question.